Good morning. I'll be reading from uh, Psalm 23 today. And uh, starting at verse 1, it says, Yahuwah is my shepherd. I shall not want. He makes me to lie down in green pastures. He leads me beside the still waters. He restores my soul. He leads me in the paths of righteousness for his name's sake. Yes, though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil, for you are with me. Your rod and your staff, they comfort me. You prepare a table before me in the presence of my enemies. You anoint my head with oil, my cup runs over. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the house or the tabernacle of Yahuwah forever. <laughs> Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life. See, that's, a, that's an, a, a confession of our faith that you and I ought to acknowledge with our mouth. Instead of talking about how bad things are, we ought to begin to proclaim, Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the house of Yahuwah forever. The scripture says that we're to hold fast the confession of our faith without wavering, for Yahuwah is faithful that promised. It also says that Yahuwah watches over his word to perform it. It also says in the scriptures that you shall be justified by your words and by your words you shall be condemned. So that the words of our mouth and the meditation of our heart be acceptable in the sight of Yahuwah. The words that come out of our mouth, let them be words of faith and, 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 and let them be words that, that proclaim the truth of the, the word of Yahuwah. For Yahuwah watches over his word to perform it in our lives. When, and, and when we acknowledge it through our mouth as an as a, as a, as expression of our faith, he watches over that word to see to it that it's carried out in your life and my life. It says in the book of Revelation chapter 12 verse 11, that they overcame him, talking about Shaitan, the enemy. They overcame him by the blood of the lamb and by the word of their testimony. And we overcome when we begin to acknowledge the truth of the word of Yahuwah. May this in, it help you today and encourage you and strengthen you today. Please share this with others as well. Shalom.